Welcome back to Androgen Cleaning. Today I'm going to show you two ways of how to unclog your toilet so that you can save money and time and hopefully that you do not have to call a professional. First and foremost, my water is blue because I tried out one of those tank tablets. You all, can I just say, I am not impressed, but more to come on that one. So what we're going to do here is we're going to take some Dawn. You know that I love this. Now right here I want you to pay attention. It says three times grease cleaning power. Okay, you're going to go ahead, you're going to dump this in your tank, not your tank, your toilet. Let's pretend this is a clog. Guys, I really didn't want to do the things, you know, I got to have some self-respect around here. <laughs> so that's your clog. You're going to dump your Dawn on up in there. There's no precise amount, half a cup maybe, something like that. You can see that there's pressure already building down there, okay? Now, you could potentially use this. This is awesome. I did a whole video on this. I will link that in the description box as well. But this has five times faster grease cleaning power. The problem with this, we're going to use both here today though, is it's not as dense. It's foamy. So it's not likely to get as deep into the drain as the pure liquid non-spray stuff. Pretty cool though, right? So a lot of reasons what happens is you get the clogs because of you know what, and there's a lot of fat deposits in our number twos. And so that's why degreasers work awesome, especially if you eat the standard American diet, we are more than healthy in that fat type of area coming out of you know what, enough said, enough said. Okay, so we're gonna let this sit for about 20 to 30 minutes and then we're gonna come back. Now that's been sitting for about 20 to 30 minutes. This next step is you're gonna get a bucket of warm water. Some people say boiling water. I do not recommend boiling water just because if this is cold and cracking and I don't know, it makes me nervous. So I would just say warm water, fill your bucket up in your shower or your tub or your kitchen sink. Now some people would say to do this before you put the dish soap in the toilet. However, if you have a clog in here, your water level is generally almost overflowing. Am I right? And the idea of putting a bucket in already overflowing water, like that's scary. But if you have a serious clog, I would put some sort of towels around the outside here just to save yourself a little bit more cleanup time. Once that's been sitting, you're gonna go ahead and take your bucket of warm water and dump it on in. and it works its way right on down. Now the idea is that this Dawn has broken down some of that grease in the poo, and so when you go to dump the bucket in there, the water level should be a little bit lower. I've done this before for, we'll say somebody else, and it has absolutely worked. <laughs> the next way to try to dislodge a clog without calling a professional is with good old saran wrap. So let's get this rocking and rolling here. I don't have a ton of this left, so I'm a little bit nervous. Clearly we've unclogged a lot of toilets in our house with this method. No, I'm just kidding, but we have. When we first moved into this house two years ago, we did not have a plunger, which doesn't make sense, but it's the truth, we didn't have a plunger. And so, I figured out how to do this, and I'm sharing it with you today. So for some reason you find yourself in that, and can I just say plungers are pretty disgusting in terms of like storing them. This toilet has been cleaned by the way. So we're gonna make a really tight seal. I've tried this with press and seal, which I love better for other things, but it did not work as well. This cling wrap is where it's at. Cling wrap, saran wrap. So get this on here. I'm gonna use hopefully just two sheets to create a nice seal. I was in school at one point, I uh, wanted to be a nurse, anesthetist, so I love science and chemistry and all things related to that. So, hence I have a cleaning channel. <laughs> okay, so we got this nice and tight. So the idea behind this is when we flush the toilet, and might I tell you this is a weak flushing toilet. When we flush the toilet, it's gonna build a pressure and then we're gonna push on that pressure and it's going to go through the pipes and dislodge that clog. That's the hope when you try this particular method. I would say if you've done the Dawn method and the warm water and that did not work, try this. If you don't want to use a plunger, you don't have one. Okay? All right. Now what's going to happen when it rises, watch me push on it. Now did you see when it reached its peak? and then I pushed down on it, kind of like popping a bubble. 
Yes. All right, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, hit me up on Instagram at Andrew Jean Co. I teach women how to turn their passions into profits, and this cleaning and organizing channel is one way that I do that. Also, lots of goodies in the description box below, and I will see you, my friend, in the next one.